Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dork's Dally. The sword is here. Dork's Dally. Here it is. Here it comes. Coming right at you. Hello. Hello, everyone. Can you hear Lily chewing? Yeah, she's just chewing she's away. She's crunching she away in the snack. background. She's having her dinner. Lily, enjoy your dinner. Anyway, it is Thursday. She's like, I'm going to do this so late. I never heard her eat ever. She's usually so dainty. Do you think it's too loud? No, it's fine. It's funny. All right, well. Over, it's Lily's helping out. You, you're gosh. here. You're, you're here with yeah. us. Lily's yeah. eating. You're part of the meal times. Horrible. It's, it's, it's fabulous. Oh, she's coming from over. But anyway, guys, it is Thursday. We had a crazy busy day today at work. Should I tell my story? Go ahead. My oil change story? Oh, of course. Guys, I had to go get the oil change today. I went to the dealership because... This is so funny. I like to go to the dealership because, like, so if anything happens, they can't be like, well, you got it done here. We don't know. Yeah, like, sure went to five-minute lube. That's what they, they yeah. do. Yeah, so you get what you pay for. So, yeah. yeah. So I went to the dealership. I'm sick. I got there. My it's actually cheaper. So it yeah, it was fine. Keep turning your thing off. I don't know why it's happened. Just no one silence. ever messages me ever now. Yeah, they do. It's all day. You're all day. I never hear it. Here's what you do. See this little button at the top? Yeah. You push it in, so it yeah. says silent. That's so cool. Okay. It's cool you can do that. Anyway, I had an appointment at 10:30. Okay. I get there at like 20 after. I'm early, of course. Early bird gets the worm. Obviously not, because I get there at 10:30. Give them my car. Everything's fine. I go sit down. I find a little cubby to sit in. I'm on doing my stuff. I notice the time. I mean, it always takes a while. Okay. It was like 10 after one. Okay. Crazy. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to ask. Just am I almost Curious. done? Curious. Like 1130, 30, We're going on three hours. Okay. I'm just going to ask. So I went up to the desk and I said, hey, um, I put my car in at 10.30. I just want to see, am I, like, anywhere close to being done on the list? Like, how much longer like, do you a, think? Do you have an approximate couple time? Hours. I'm, I'm very nice, hours. you know? And the girl... She, tell me, before she finishes this, tell me if this girl should have said this. Because I would have said something completely different. But go ahead. So, the girl's looking through the papers. What's your last name? Blah, blah, blah. She's looking through. She gets the paper out and she goes, oh, my God. She's like, I hate that I have to say this to you. And I'm like... You're like, my car's blowing up? <laughs> or, I actually thought she was going to say it's going to be another, like, two hours. That's really what I thought she was going to say, because I was all prepared to be like, do you have a shuttle service, something? Because yeah. I can't stay in here much longer. I had to come home to walk Lily. So anyway, I'm like, oh my god. I was like, what? She's like, your car was finished at 1130. Guys, she say, I sat there. Like, let's do shots. Listen, <laughs> let's do five. I needed oh to do five God. shots after that. Guys, I sat there and watched all people. The guy comes out. They, like, review the paper with you. They're like, oh, yeah, you know, you're going to need an air, air filter soon. We can get by this time without it, but next time you're going to need it, okay? New tires, like, you better get ready for that because it's coming. All the things they do, the checklists, the the. The green means good, yellow means you need it soon, and red is like, How's your you need it. Yellow on the brakes. Brakes is not bad? No, the yellow's in the middle. Like, you're going to, like, need them at some point, obviously. Well, shit, we didn't put brakes on yet. No, so. like, five years old. Yeah, <laughs> <Something> so. <laughs> so, guys, could you imagine, why didn't she just not say that? Why I was just lying Why didn't yeah. she just say, oh, Guess what? Your paper just came across my desk, so I was just about to get someone to come get you. And I would have been like, oh, good, I'm glad I came up. Yeah, and yeah. the whole thing would have just been positive. But instead, I was, like, so mad. What but I was so did nice to have... her. Yeah. And you know what she said to me to try to make it better? She's like, it's always people like you that don't want to, like, cause a fuss and, like, that this happens to. You should make it over a minute. <laughs> Cut the shit out of you. <laughs> I was like, you know what? You know what, lady? I'm, I'm gonna like, give you the microphone. Next time. Get over so here do you know what microphone. I did? This is a good one. Wait, I didn't even tell you what I, I did. Didn't do. Bob I didn't even tell you what I did do. I left my purse. Because by the way, guys, I always sit in this room. It's called like a working room. They have them, their little cubbies. I don't sit with the, the gen pop. Okay? Uh, so I sit in a, in like an office. You hide out. Yeah. So Wait, I, you find an office? It's kind of like an office, but it's not like an office. There's a desk in there and a chair, and it says, like, for working customers, like, people in there with a laptop, like, they're oh, doing Oh, you're doing everything. You got a job? I do. Ah! 
Oh, you wait, Hello. Uh, I was in there editing my video. Uh, hi, can I go in somewhere to edit my video? You don't have to ask. Video? You don't have to ask. There's no, like, permission. I have a YouTube channel, The Cruise Dorks. Yeah. Um, my so, husband's really fat. He's massively obese. And we go on all these cruises where we just eat out of control. And it's just a lot of fun. Finish? Okay. I just can't believe so it. So I left my purse. Why am I here working like a lunatic? I was working the whole time. I was doing my I'm video. Joking, we are were. Anyway, Lily, please. Since I was in this little cubby, when I went to talk to the girl, I left my purse in there and my phone yeah. because I wanted to save my spot. Okay, move your meat, lose your seat is not me. So I'm keeping my stuff there. Yeah. So in case I was expecting to have to wait longer. Yeah, yeah. I thought she was gonna be like, Two, um, soon, you know. And uh, so I wanted to make sure I left my stuff there. So anyway, I had to go back to get it. And there was a bunch of people in the waiting room. I was like, and I heard someone over talking. They were like, I've been waiting. And I was like, hey, just so you know, if you've been waiting a long time, don't be afraid to check because my car's been done for an hour and a half now and I had no idea. And they were like, what? Honestly, you So did everybody like, like got up. Done. I was like. Did you get a lot of videos? And you went like that. I told you, girl. Or no, <laughs> you got the wrong I got the whole. I got the well, whole. We are I'm not saying. troublemakers. We are. But that wasn't making trouble. I was giving them a solid because, yo, don't just sit there and think they're coming to get you. Guys, I nobody came and got me. I would have sat there all day. Yes. Do you know they never would have came and got me? No. I would have been like four o'clock, and they would have been like, "Man, I have hey, been I've bullied. seen you sitting here way too long." Right, I've been bullied multiple times. Well, we know that. And Usually, I would have spoke up sooner, but I was actually doing something, so it took up that whole time. So yeah. it's whatever. But yeah, that's how my day started. That might have gotten okay? me over it. There's like certain things I can't accept. That might have been one, even though no, if the girl would have came out like so that, nice. it would have hard to yell at her. No, yeah. the girl was so nice, you wouldn't have been mad at her. Like, she was but young, I mean, like, yo, nobody was thought like, to, like, ask. She, wasn't, she was nice. So if she had a tude, then it would have been, like, yeah. I would have been fired I wouldn't mind seeing the report card. I like that they do that. What if it's honest? They always know. do that. Everywhere you go, they give you a little report card. They don't. Except maybe this Take 5. But any, like, normal place you go. They do it. Yeah, because they're trying to get you to buy stuff while you're there. How was our air filler? They didn't say anything. I didn't really. I think it was good. So you went up and the dude came out and gave you a Nobody rundown. came up. Nobody ever gave me a rundown. Even after you paid? She gave me the paper and was just like, here, just sign here and here. She didn't say one word about oh, it. No, I don't get the spiel. I didn't, thank God. I hate I that I don't get spiel. the spiel. I hate the guy that comes out and he's all like trying to act like he's on your team. You're if like, there's anybody Sir, Italian out there, by the way. Not on my side. And I just said, Bashil, can you let me know what that is? All right, we're not going to. St I'm not saying no more. Stop the deep. Just I'm not going to play Because go. right. there's got to be somebody that's Italian. Especially the girl from uh, up in uh, Connecticut that came in the barbershop. Okay. She might know. She might. All right, listen, guys. Let's talk about cruising because I am behind already. I still got to finish packing. Come on. We're leaving tomorrow. No, we're not leaving tomorrow, but basically we are. Tomorrow's the last night. It's the last night. Oh, my God. All right, guys. Vincent watches sometimes. Yes. My cousin. Cousin Bashil, he knows exactly what a Bashil is. All okay. Right. So let's talk about cruising, okay? Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, God forbid. All right. We found out something that we did not know. That Disney doesn't do a dinner buffet. That's crazy, guys. Like, what? Are you kidding me? No dinner buffet on are Disney. So we're like, me? um... What do they do no, to make up for that? There can't just no, be dinner. I don't need to go to the dinner. dining room. They want you. That's it. Guys, if I booked no that cruise ship and they didn't have a buffet, if I paid I would have a break all that day. money and there's no dinner buffet, somebody's gonna. What? They gotta produce one. They gotta well, set no, one up. Let me up. ask you a question. I'm guessing you have to wear pants in their dining room, right? Probably. What if I had no pants? I wouldn't have known that. I would never. No, well, I, mean, I never would have Obviously, that. I would have looked up the buffet, though. Yeah, we would have figured it out beforehand. Are we certain? Somebody told us this. Who told us this? Who I read it. I read it. That there's no buffet. I mean, is that wrong? Tell me if that's wrong info. Nice. But that's what I read. I don't know that's if someone funny. sent it to me or if I read it or both. I, I'm so busy. I, I have no idea today. I Carmel's, don't even know what my name is. Today. Even Carmel's got a wreck of a buffet, but they have a Yeah, the, the buffet is there. Now, do you want to eat it? That's up for debate, but it is there. What else do we got to talk what? about? Oh, let's talk about Carnival for a minute. Speaking of Carnival, Carnival is going to go back since a lot of people complained, well, and I think I remember away. this, the hand cut fries at Guy's Burger. They're on a cruise. They're going to go back to it. They got rid of it and put garbage fries, okay? And nobody wants them. And people have complained, so they're going back. Some of the ships have already done it, but the majority have not. So they're all going to they're gonna change over at some point. I yes. don't know when, but yeah. 
The That's pretty awesome. The three on, Peg and Artie. Artie told me, I believe, yes. that they had the pretzels. I mean, the pretzels. Yeah, for pretzels. Us. Right? Isn't that what yeah. happened? And I was I like, no, that. that's not true. And it's been a while. They've actually Dude, that was ride these fries now, out for a minute. Was that over a year ago? It's two years. It was in don't 2022. Don't guys. Don't tell me. Yeah, it was two years ago. Wow. You have no concept I'm of so time. Old. How much time has gone by? Why don't you realize how are your age? I'm not going to be old. I'm Do you so look in the old. mirror? <laughs> I'm so old. <laughs> First of all, that's mean to make fun of that. You know my father has dementia, and you know that now I'm... Well, you're, now I you have basically dementia. have it now. Yeah. So, Jim's ready for the home anytime. I'm practicing, guys. Whoever wants Forget to take him is practicing. ready to go. What? Where am I? Yes. Speaking about Carnival, guys, Carnival has revealed... This is, like, new info. <laughs> okay, so Carnival, Carnival Cruise Line revealed... This is brand new info, okay? They revealed... Is this revealed by John Heald? No. Okay. This is just a, a revelation. There you go. Carnival revelation, okay? You know their new beach place, Celebration Key? Yeah. Okay? They it. revealed a new cove. Pearl Cove. Why? And guess what it is? I didn't even know about that. It's adults only. Why? Adults only, okay? It's going to be a beach club there. It's going to be similar after reading it, but wait till the end. Because it is not similar at all it's to stupid. Royal. It's okay, listen to this. All right, Carnival, uh, the Pearl Cove Beach Club on the Celebration Key with Carnival. Okay, it's only for guests 18 and older. Okay. And it has all the bells and whistles, swim up bar. It has a uh, full service restaurant with an elevated menu. Okay, and here's the prom. You ready for the proms? Mm -hmm. Now, look, when you book a reservation for this option, I guess, Pearl Cove, okay? There's three options. All right? This is like going to a place. Listen, there's three options to book this, okay? The first one, club access plus a welcome drink. No. Listen, so you, the yeah. first option, I don't know prices. There was no prices. Wait, you sh okay. So there's no prices. So, for so the first club access, you get, uh, you just get to go in. Yeah. And you get a welcome drink. So yeah. one drink. Okay. okay. Next, club access plus open bar. Listen to this though. You're going to be like, club access, so you get to go, open bar, but here's the kicker. Give it to me. It's a 10 drink maximum. What? Yeah. What are they doing? Listen to this. Here's the third option. What are you doing? Club Carnival? access. What are you doing, John? Somebody write John a letter. Okay, let me tell the third option. Tell it. Club I'm access so with an open bar. And you get to go to the restaurant, but still only 10 drinks. 10 drinks. Uh, John, ten I'd like drinks. to talk to you about the 10 drink situation. Hold on, let me get my proper hand positioning. You only want to do that when you hold it, John. John, I'd like to know why you're uh, telling your guests that they can only have 10 drinks when they're at um, the, uh, what's the name of the place? It's going to be uh, Pearl Cove I in Celebration Key. Thing. It's not called Perfect Day at Coco K. Mm -mm. Okay, because you wouldn't have these problems. When you're in Coco so, K, you can get as many drinks as your little heart yes. desires. Thank you, John. And then you're probably saying, mm -hmm. well, why do you got to drink like that? Because well, you, know you want John, to, and you that's know, why you're there. Yeah, you're on vacation. John, I know what you okay? drink, John. You, you, t you would never go at a 10-drink limit. 10 drinks. You're going to pay to go to this adults-only celebration key, and all you can have is 10 drinks? Are you nuts? What are you doing? You can't do that. 10? No. Now, yeah. let me ask you a question. You can get there probably like early as 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, maybe 10. And what time do they leave? Even if you don't want more than 10 drinks. Yeah, like I don't they like the still limit. shouldn't cap you. I don't like that feeling. And it's no. unnecessary. It's no, got to have something to do with them giving Yeah, but if you feel like, if you feel like that you have to do this for your clientele, you got to rethink your whole brand. Yeah. Because that's messed up. That these people that are going on Carnival, and I don't believe this to be true. I just think there's isolated fights. But I don't think Carnival guests as a whole need to be limited to yeah. 10 drink minutes. Yeah, these fights, okay? guys. Okay, like, there's fights. Yeah. There's isolated they're fights. We joke big. and all. Right. But it's we not yeah. everybody that it's, cruises yes. Carnival. Yes. It's just funny it really to is. joke I about. love making fun of it because it's something to make fun yeah, of. Yeah, it's okay? just stupid. I grew up in Philadelphia, but so I'm... We've been on geez. a million Carnival cruises, okay? This fine. I mean, it's not like people are like. I heard there's fights on like, there all day. I'm like, no. no. There's like one fight. I have never think have about we ever it. seen one. Um, no. Uh, I'm trying to think. About it. The only thing I ever seen was these young guys were messing with this 
like lady that looked like she was like, I want to say like. Yeah, but that wasn't a fight. We've yeah. never seen a brawl. Okay, so we've never seen a brawl, and we've seen crowded hot tubs, things, other things we didn't like, broken I've furniture. Never seen a punch but we've never so. Sixteen. This, how are you gonna have an adults only area and limit like they're in prison? Like yeah, it's like you're treating them like it's children. It's like imagine when you go it's up weird. and get your last one. They are the ones who started the dogs here in uh, Cape Canaveral. Listen, you they go get your last dogs. drink. You know how depressing that is? If you're at that adults only thing and you get your last drink. Yeah. And, and like, some of our people, it? like some of our this friends, like it? used to like carnival. They did mm -hmm. carnival. They're gamblers. Like they very well at carnival. A lot of people love like carnival because of all these cutbacks and restrictions. And I think that this whole new island thing, I don't really, I don't like that ten drink minimum. Why don't they at least even do the fifteen that you get on the drink package? I don't know. Like, why did they make it 10? And I know people are going to say, like, oh, we were only out there five, six hours. No, man, I was out there for a minute. So what, if I you're drinking, you. like, Coors Lights, Miller Lights, uh, Michelob Ultra, you can, like, throw them back. I can do 12. And you're at a pool bar? I want 12. There like, 12 on what if you want no, 11? How about this? Are you, are you, after that 10 limit, they can never get done anymore. For the rest of the day. I don't know. I don't know the specifics. I don't know if that goes against your drink package. I don't know. I just know that this is the cost. There's three different like cost price tiers right. for this uh, Pearl Cove. I don't yeah. know prices or anything. Yeah. So I like it. that's nuts, guys. I'm very disappointed. What do you think about the ten drink minimum? Do you think there should be a minimum? Let us know. I mean. A maximum. If you go to the bottom minimum. here, you'll see like a little layer. You can write down. What You're not you gonna think see anything, it. but you can just cite, write it. That's right. <sighs> anyway, what else do we got? Oh, the Norwegian Encore. What about it? Is going to go under extensive updates to oh. deliver a more elevated experience to its guest. This morning, you went on like a weird rant while I was like in the shower. Or was it yesterday you went on a weird rant? No. And I swear Norwegian was involved. Like, you were angry at Norwegian. What happened so bad with Norwegian this morning that you went on that Nothing. Um, yesterday? I have no idea. Do you think I remember, like, an hour ago? I'm nuts uh, right now. I got so much going Did you going try on. to, like, book a cruise with no. them and it was real expensive or something? No. Oh, uh, I swear you were like, Norwegian. I'm like, what's going on? She's having no. a breakdown. She's cruise dorking it out right now about another cruise. Yeah. A cruise line has nothing to do because right now Michelle wants to look up this cruise ship and that cruise ship and that cruise ship. When I'm like, we have to face the cruise ship that we're it's in front of us, and that is the princess. I'm always Enchanted in the future. Princess. I'm always you in can't the future. Do that though. We don't know this. I ship. live in the future. Then what happens is we, we get on the, the past, ship, and the then we don't know what's going on because we're like, oh, we've been what looking up we the uh, emperor of the seas. What do you mean we've looked it up? No, we didn't look it up a million times. I bet we don't know nothing about that cruise when we get on there besides You don't know the anything until you get there, regardless I of know, what you watch. I know, but I'd like to know what I'm going to order. Well, then watch it. No one's stopping you. No, I'm saying. In the middle of the night when you're playing your you video games, watching, go watch it. You, I do that, by the Okay. Way. Uh, Every night I'm busy with my videos, I so I haven't even watched any I TV that, at all. I do that, by the way. Just so you know, I've watched no TV at all. Look. I'm you watch TV, say, not me. So put on whatever you want. You do put stuff on. She always wants to put on a ship that's another ship. Because I'm, said, like I said, I'm always in the future. Ship. We're not doing I'll that see the Enchanted anymore. Princess when I'm on it. That's right. Okay. Damn right you will. Mm -hmm. Damn right you will. And we're bringing the projector, guys. So look out for that video the projector in your room movie night. Anyway. Can we get back to the Norwegian Encore? Yeah. Okay. Encore. The Nor Norwegian Encore will go under extensive updates, okay, to enhance its guest experience. Yeah. All right. They're going to have a brand new Spice H2O. All right. The expansion of two dining venues, Cagney's and Teppanyaki. And they're going to have redesigned suites in the Haven and 24 new balcony staterooms. I think they're going to make the Haven suites three bedrooms instead of two. Yeah. Which is odd. Maybe they have the need. Maybe people want to book suites with bigger families. You know, so they're yeah. adding a third bedroom, which like is that. nice. Yeah. yeah, so after the Encore's two-week dry dock from November 18th to December 2nd, guests will have the opportunity to indulge in the new Spice H2O. Wow. The adults-only complimentary outdoor area. So it's like the solarium. Yeah. So theirs is called Spice H2O. Okay? No, well, Spice H2O, isn't that weird? It's complimentary. Oh, okay. I thought that was what it mean. You no, that was to, called the vibe. The vibe. I don't even know if that exists anymore. I'm no. We thought we were so cool getting into the vibe. We went was, like twice. We went twice. Yeah. I think we went once, but twice sounds good. I'll, I'll say it. twice. I might have went myself. I don't remember. You did, yeah. Okay, so it's the adults-only complimentary outdoor area tucked away from the main pool uh, deck. The space will replace the laser tag. So they're going to get rid of the laser tag, and they're expanding this. They're putting this there. 
Okay. So laser tag will be no more on the Encore. I guess nobody wants to go, so they're like, let's get rid of that. Okay. And they're going to have, it, it's going to have, what is it going to have? It's going to have some stuff. I wrote it down, I thought. Wait, so the Encore is new? No, it's not new because it's going under updates. It's going oh, into dry dock. Dry. I saw and it's going to get a bunch of new yeah. stuff. It's going to have this whole new um, like adults board. only area, which like is going to be really cool. Yeah. And uh, yeah. I really like the solarium on Royal Guys. That's oh, a great yes. idea. And it's never packed. I mean, I don't know. I want to let people in No, the show. solarium was amazing. It was so big. I liked how big and open it was. Yeah. You never felt like you were crowded in next to people. You could, I like that. You could stay there and eat and everything. Yeah, you could you just spend a lot of your cruise on the solarium. Yeah, if yeah, we did that ship again or one idea. of those ships again, I was planning on doing that. Yeah. But Honestly, now once the Encore is out of dry dock, it's going to embark on a 12-day transatlantic voyage from Southampton, uh, United Kingdom to Miami. And then it's going to be in Miami for, you know, regular Caribbean sailings, you know, the huge. The huge. Yeah. So. That sounds cool. Yeah. Check so. That out. Yeah, so that's fun. The Encore, we haven't been on Norwegian in a minute. I love Norwegian. In a few years, I don't like their food. So it's their food's that's whatever, my thing. but I don't know. Yeah, they like the food. The food's like big I know for me. I say it all the I time. I like certain foods, yeah. and I want the foods I like. I'll tell you what their disappointment was. At the time, we were doing Celebrity and Carnival. Mm -hmm. Carnival, we were going to David's at least once. We were doing that awesome restaurant in Celebrity. What was it called? Cuisine. Cuisine was the greatest restaurant ever, I thought. And we go on there and i was so excited because you get two dinners or three dinners i think it was and we were like all right we're gonna oh, yeah the dining, dining package you know you can yeah. get that like on all the lines you can get a dining package we can get that on celebrity no but no, i'm just saying thing. we never really talk about that yeah you can always get a dining package we could have got right. it on this one too on the utopia this would probably be awesome too utopia. yeah utopia I'm so mad be... we didn't go to that restaurant i don't even want to talk about it well do Forget you want to go on again you don't want to go on again um jim doesn't want to go on again i do want to go on again no, you don't. You complain about it. I just want you to never say anything positive leave. about it. I just, I just don't. You like? I, I didn't really like it. Guy. It's not true. I said I love the royal. Thank you. No, no, I that utopia. You I love the utopia. Fan. I did love the utopia. Then why do you say you don't like it? I said I can't do seven nights on the utopia. I feel like you need to because you have no time. I, I just don't think I can handle it. If I had a why? drink package for was, seven nights, all the gin what do you I was mean? drinking. We have the drink package on every cruise, and you can handle it just fine. I, I just don't. Right? No, I don't drink like that usually. Well, on you don't Royal, have I to... felt now in Royal, I feel like I had a drink. Why? I feel like I was at like in Vegas. Like if I don't oh, drink, okay. it's not cool. Sorry okay. if I felt that way. Why well, didn't they feel you like that? You have to attack me for this, but I. Well, I felt wish you that. felt like that on every cruise. Why well, don't we have more fun? Well, sometimes <laughs> on the cruise, it's just like it's like a, a funeral at times where you're just like I don't feel like drinking, or you start you to make drink, your own fun. and then you're kind of like done. A celebrity does a great job of keeping people partying, but Royal was like an outdoor like party. Yeah, that was like. That was a lie. It took, four nights is perfect for you. You're like this yeah. pumping on. Yeah. We did it one more night. That would have made it a four night cruise. That would have been. Like, I bet all the people that did the four nights told you it was awesome. Four nights. Oh, yeah. Another four nights. So, seven altogether would have been perfect. Because ah, we, we could have got crazy. everything done that we, we didn't get to do the things that we wanted to do. Because you need a day off. So, when you like go nuts one night, the next day you want to chill. You don't feel like going to restaurants and all. So, you need like that third day. Don't yeah. you agree you need a day off? So if you have a seven night cruise, you can take those days off in between. I think a four nighter you can too. Four nights is better than three. I'd rather do four. Because here's the thing, I should have drank the last night. Because the first night's like a blur. We had a day off, so when I would I would have had Monday and then I had to go back Tuesday. So it's like for this cruise, for instance. I mean, I know we're driving, whatever. So I don't really want to be hungover, but yeah. like I really wasn't hungover. The gin didn't really get me hungover, man. Mm -hmm. I started out hungover. I woke up that way, and then I was like, all right, no, I'm good to go. Well, as long as you keep drinking, you're good. Yeah. You just can't stop cold turkey. You can't need stop, like a bloody stop, mary. Stop, can't stop. You got to keep the party going. Go. You know. We're gonna party on the ship. This with, uh, the princess. Oh Everybody says we're gonna the oldies. With the golden oldies? We're going to be the golden oldies. What if we're, I feel like we're going to be surprised and it's really not. Everyone keeps acting like it's going to be like a snooze fest. Like, you said about celebrity. But I, I feel like Florida cruises are different. I don't care what line Old it is. Old people in Florida people are, are like, different. Yeah, they party. <laughs> yeah. Like 90 years old. I think at 95 they slow down. down yeah, maybe. But like anyone in their 80s, they're like getting it in. Yeah, they're, they're like, they think they, you're like a dud. Like, okay, we cut a Marine tear yesterday. Her father was a Marine. Awesome, great. They're all still Marines, you know how that is. And I, they were both, he was older. He was 81, 84. 
was 84. He was like Korea almost. And, um, and like her dad just, you know, worked out, ran his whole life. And I'm like, that guy yesterday, he was so like little with energy. Didn't he? Yeah. He was like, yeah, oh, you oh don't my God. Need to yeah. quit. I'm like, damn, dude. Yeah. Anyway, what else do we got? We don't really have nothing else. The only other thing I had was about speaking of the royal ships, the big ships. There was a lot of people complaining that they don't like how the the like how packed the icon is. I heard that people were well, complaining they are. that they it's have like too 6, crowded. like people on it because a double occupancy plus that's, kids. That's what it says the ship's capacity is, but it's really going over that. It's like not a hundred percent capacity. It's like one thirty or one thirty six yeah. because. Every stateroom, it doesn't just have two people. They might have two kids, too. Right. So now you got four people in a stateroom. And how many staterooms of that do you have? So now you're, like, way over the 100%. Nice. I, I would imagine how many people. So a lot of people were complaining about it. Hey, here's what I say. you got to be prepared for that when you do one of those cruises. Yeah. If you don't like it, don't go on one of them. Because you don't know. It sucks, though, because these people want to go on it because it's advertised to go on and have a great yeah, time. You got to see. A lot of money. There could be a million people on here. I and you're know, but be ready to deal. I say wait if you can. Don't just go. Why would you want to cruise? Why do you feel like you have to go on a cruise in the summer? I know a lot of you have to work. But I, I know kids, getting a bit. I know kids. But I know a lot of people don't have kids and they don't do it. And I'm just like, why Why don't you just cruise in the winter where you can really like. Yeah, winter time is my favorite time. It's a little but, chiller. Like, yeah. I mean, I don't know what you're going to do. Them big ships are a good time. I don't blame people for going on them. I know I had a great some people time. did have a bad time. I watched some videos where people had a bad time. But I just, I didn't. I prefer celebrity. I prefer the older people cruises and princess. But I'll tell you why. I had a I had a good time on that cruise. Yeah, like I honestly had mixed reviews. Um, even in the video, I'm making the second video today, guys. It'll be out on Sunday. You started like getting um, down the second day. The second day, I was kind of like, I don't really like this. I was mad. Too. I was like, like complaining a little bit, but watching it back, I'm like, this is fun. Like I don't know, watching it back, I have a different like. Just do that. When I'm like a the when I'm like it's over, I'm yeah. like. No, it was fine. Like, yeah, you the food wasn't like that bad. So you're like, I think, oh, it's today everything's wrong. I'm like, what? There was just bad Indian. There was. Yeah. The but Indian, it was like, there was. A, I was looking at the buffet. There was a lot of other stuff, too. Here's though. what bothered me, though. You it's had whatever. a chicken Indian dish. Like, they had, like, chicken tikka, right? Then they had this, like, mushroom vegetarian dish. But there's you have to have complimentary dishes. Now, that would actually work with the chicken tikka. But you have mushroom dish, and that's your main mm -hmm. one. You didn't even think that. Like, you had no... Like, to me, There's that's no like, you don't care. There's no thought put into these selections, okay, yeah. for the vegetarian Celebrity, guys, people. go on Celebrity. Go on that one we just were on. What was it called? Which one? The Apex? The Apex. That dude, that chef, look him up, that man, and remember that face. When that They're dude's all running good. It, oh, but we he, had a great food. This chef that was on the Apex last time, he might be gone now. But if he's on there, the same chef we had, yeah, he was fabulous. If you like that food. Yeah. It, it was good. But anyway, guys. Oh, wait. There's one more story you one. forgot. I don't know if you did it on purpose or what. Why did I forget? That specialty cruise. The golden oh my God, I totally forgot about this. <gasps> oh my God, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me get this up, okay? Let me get this up. Listen to this cruise, all right? This cruise is going to be amazing. The microphone because it's old time. I can't do it because I feel like I have to change my voice. I don't know why. You can do that. It. That's perfect for us. I don't want to tell the whole story. Okay, you ready? All right, next year... There's a voyage, okay? It's on the Celebrity Reflection. It's on the Celebrity Reflection, okay? And it's a theme cruise. Guess what the theme is? You're never going to guess. I can't guess. The Golden Girls, okay? The Golden Girls. People dress up they like the Golden Girls. Golden Girls. Jim, hello. He's all ready to go. B. I, Arthur like big in B. full Arthur. effect, yes. okay? I'll be. Let my hair grow out. Who should I be? Girl. Betty White? Why do you do Betty White? Or Blanche. Cool? You look, you're like a Blanche. Blanche? But my hair's not short. Betty White, I can like curl my hair. You can be the old lady. The real old Sophia? Lady. You know Sophia was younger. Oh, I'll be Sophia. She Sophia was, like was the one. youngest yeah. member of that cast, guys. So How crazy is that? Actually, we would be her mom. I don't know. I love Sophia. She was so mean. Actually, I would be Sophia. She was so tough. Yeah, I like Sophia. I'll yeah. be her. But I gotta just, I don't know what I can do with my hair, though. I have all this hair. We'll just shave it off. But anyway, guys, it's gonna be. You wear wigs, on... right? No, I wouldn't wear wigs. It's going to, you don't need one. All right. It's going to be on the Celebrity Reflection March the 9th of March next 9th. year. And guess what? This is, they've been doing this every year. I don't know how many years, but consecutive years they've been doing it. And next year is going to be the last one. Who the, says the last that? one. So the last one if you 
would like to go on a Golden Girls cruise, this is going to be our last chance. So last okay? chance. Guess what? Guess what? March 9th, 25. And I was looking at prices. Okay, by the way, not too bad. Not too shabby. Yeah, oh, no. you are? Yeah, not too bad. Yeah, what's the numbers like? It's like thirteen seventy five cheapest way. How many nights? Twenty one fifty one for a, a balcony. How many nights? Um, I don't know. That's a good. That's a good that's question. It's probably like four nights. I don't know how many nights it is. Adam but if Miami you can look it up, guys, it's March 9, twenty twenty five. It's down there somewhere. Miami I think Fort Lauderdale. Call me if you want to book it. I'm booking cruises now. I'll book it if you want to book it. No, book it Jim up. doesn't book anything. I'm booking it. He doesn't even book haircuts. Yep, I am. People I don't trust them. They don't. It's so weird. I'm like, oh, do you want to go in for the next month? They're like, like, I'll just call Michelle. I'm like, are you sure? Because I can put you in right now. Next thing you know, the dude comes back in. Back in mm -hmm. and put some. He's like going through the book. I'm like, are you all right? You need he's help? Like, he's like, just do it. People I'll would rather book themselves than have Jim book them. The one who showed up 15 is. minutes later, I said, dude, you booked yourself and miss. You put your name in <laughs> and you came in. Sometimes I see weird random writing because I do everything in pen, uh, pencil on paper. Okay. There's no computers, it's all in pencil. All right. So sometimes I You're go so through the old book. School. You're so old. I am. Okay, so I go through the book and I see this weird random writing. I'm like, all right, this isn't my writing or yours. I'm like, did this person put themselves the in? Random writer, yeah. I'm like, come on. How about that little kid I booked today? I booked him as a little guy. Yeah, that's, that's what how I Jim knew. Put him in. Chris, I well, was you know like, what? The best thing Jim does is he just puts a line. I do. Well, that's how I didn't feel. He just laid it. I don't just know a line. names, guys. And and some people I can't. I sh I cannot not write a name down. Yeah, some people have been our customers now names. for like four years, and Jim still don't know his name. I mean, most of them. Anyone that I know, I know their name. I only know their name because I write it. If I yeah. didn't write their name, I wouldn't know their name. Because when they come in, I and I say, "Hey, Tom. Hey, Chris." I like know it because I keep repeating it. And I'm I'm bad with names, but I never forget a face. Mm -hmm. I just don't know me. You're real good with that. I'll forget a face. Jim, don't forget nobody. He'll remember somebody from like 20 years ago. I'm like, I don't I don't know who that guy is. He's like, you don't remember him? I'm like, I'm no. like, dude, that's a dude. <laughs> that's a dude. The dude, the dude. The dude, the, 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 yeah, dude, dude stuff. The whatchamacallit. So what do you think about that cruise? Let me know, guys, if you want to go on that cruise. Yes. And I have a question of the day. Well, yesterday's question of the day was, what's your top five movies? I didn't know that was the question of the day. Today, but I have a trivia question. What? What is a trivia question? What is the worst movie ever? What's your worst movie ever? How about that? You want to know my worst You want movie them ever? to say it, you say it. Man, my worst movie ever. I don't want to tell them because if they can say it then. So I'll tell them tomorrow. All right. They can guess tonight. Third time. I don't know what that is. I have to really think. Worst movie ever. I don't know any movie that we've seen the past uh, three years. It doesn't just, have to just be, write it, them it all. Can be all time. I know. My worst movies are all the movies that have come out since 2020. Since 2020? Mm -hmm. yeah. Everyone. It's just they're weird. Every movie since 2020. I don't get Gone. them. I turn them on and I go to watch it. I don't really understand. I feel like most of the movie are just telling me like who you are, and I'm like, I don't really know yeah, what the story's I'm not, about. I'm not, I don't want to deal with agendas in movies. Yeah, like and that's all you got. Me. Don't do it to me. So yeah, so that's don't my. I'll just say that. It's forget my about me. All right, guys, we're don't, gonna see you tomorrow. Don't, don't, I have so don't. much to do. I have to go walk Lily, and I have I to eat dinner. pack, eat everything. I didn't eat shit. Yet. Have a good night. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Worst movie ever. What is it?